Guys, the first step we're going to take is to head over to Google and search for Minimax. Next, click on Try Now, but make sure you've already created an account. This is the text-to-speech create box on the right. As you can see, we have Home, Voice Library, Text-to-Speech, Music, Voice Design, Voice Clone, Voice Isolator, and more. Now, the next step is to click on Text-to-Speech. Here we have different models available, Speech 2.5 HD, Speech 2.5 Turbo, Speech 02 HD, and many others. But for now, the best one to use is Speech 2.5 HD. All right, guys, let's start creating our text-to-speech voiceover. The first step is to paste your script or prompt right here. Then we need to select a voice. There are plenty of options, so let's check out the voices in our library. Here's the first voice. Let's play it. Picture this. Moonlight, ancient castle. And a mystery waiting to be solved. Now, the second voice. Let's hear it. Let me share with you what I've learned over the years. My experience has taught me that patience is truly a virtue. I kind of like the second one. So the next thing we'll do is click here to save that voice. Then cancel, head back to voice settings, and open collected voices. Guys, these are the voices we just saved. Now click on use, then generate. In a quiet little village, there was a boy named Toby. He didn't have much, but he always shared what he had. When the old farmer's bucket broke, Toby carried water for him. When the baker's daughter dropped her bread, Toby helped pick it up with a smile. Listening to it, you can hear the quality is actually very good. If we want to edit the voice, we just go into settings, then auto. Here we can select the emotional tone we want, happy, sad, angry, fearful, and more. We can also adjust the speed, pitch, and volume until it matches exactly what we like. Another cool feature is the voice modifier. When we click here, you'll see we can increase the deepness, adjust the strength, or even add a nasal effect. Now, if we like this particular voice, all we have to do is click download. And as you can see, the voiceover is now downloaded directly to our desktop. Next, let me show you how to generate a custom voice. Scroll down and click on voice design. Under the prompt, you'll see an example, excited and enthusiastic male tech vlogger. This is where we can enter the type of expression or style we want the AI voice to use. For this example, let's paste this prompt. Classic old Hollywood movie narrator. Deep, resonant male voice. Dramatic and slightly formal. Now scroll down and paste your short story script. Here. Then click generate. In a quiet little village. There was a boy named Toby. He didn't have much, but he always shared what he had. When the old farmer's bucket broke, Toby carried water for him. The first result sounds really nice. Let's play the second one too. In a quiet little village, there was a boy named Toby. He didn't have much, but he always shared what he had. Personally, I like the first one better. So we'll click select voice, give it a name. Let's call it Calm AI. Set the gender to male, language to English, then click save. And just like that, we can download our new custom voice. Now, let me show you how to create a text-to-speech voiceover using your own voice. Click on voice clone. Here, you can either record your voice or upload an existing sample. I already recorded mine, so I'll just click upload voice. This one is called hook one. Once it finishes uploading to Minimax, scroll down and choose an accent. English, Chinese, French, or others. Here's the short story prompt I'm using. Before creating, we just confirm that we have the rights and authorization to use the voice sample, accept the terms, then click create. Now let's hear it. Hello, I'm delighted to assist you with our voice services. Choose a voice that resonates with you and let's begin our creative audio journey together. Wow, as you can see, it sounds almost identical to my real voice, which is impressive. If you want to fine tune it, you can remove background noise, enable accent optimization, then confirm. Add a short description, set gender, select English, then click save. It'll be saved directly to your account and ready to use. Now let's move on to music creation with Minimax. 
Click on Music. Here we have two options, simple and advanced. With simple, you just paste a short prompt, for example, adventure song with intense sound. Minimax will instantly generate music based on that. But with advanced, you can take it one step further. For example, you could ask ChatGPT to help you write professional lyrics, then paste them here, and Minimax will turn those lyrics into a complete track. Let's click Create. And here's the music Minimax generated. Let's play it back. Dust on my boots, the path unknown Sunrise, fire on stone Whispers of the ancient call Standing tall before Guys, this sounds like it was produced by a professional composer, and that's how you create music. Before we wrap up, let's quickly look at the pricing. Scroll down and click on subscribe. Here you'll see the free plan, starter, and creator tiers. For this tutorial, everything I've shown you was done on the free plan. With it, you can generate music, create speech in over 40 languages, and use multiple accents with tons of unique voices. Honestly, it's a solid option for anyone starting out. Personally, I'm sticking with the free plan because it gives me everything I need to produce high-quality faceless YouTube videos.